We serve a God who changes things and changes people just by opening his mouth. You've got to remember that in creation, all of creation came into being simply with two words. That is when God stepped out in chaos and opened his mouth and just said, let there be. You've got to understand that God never took a bulldozer and began to dig the rivers and the sea. But God just opened his mouth and said, let there be. Let the firmament divide themselves and the land and the water divide themselves. Water, you stay in your place and mountain and hills, you stay in your place. You got to understand that when God created the heavens and the earth, he never took a plow to plow the ground and then sowed the seed in the ground. But God just said, let there be and the blades of grass begin to appear. Leaves on the tree begin to spout flowers began to bloom. You got to understand that when God got ready to put fish in the ocean he did not have to see the fish but rather he just said let there be. And when God created man you got to understand he created man in his own image and he created man in his own likeness. The Bible said how he scooped man down out from the dust of the ground and blew into his nostrils the breath of life and man became a living soul. Which means that you got some God in you and if you know you got some God in you uh, sometimes the only thing you got to do is open your mouth uh, and say let it be uh.